fun. Boom, here we go. What's up guys? Welcome back to another video. And this is the United Career Mode, as you will all know if you have watched the final uh, last two episodes, which are on the channel. So just have a look on the channel, last uploads. Two videos will be there. Not on a sports one, it's not very eventful. As you can see uh, from today's title, we will be completing the Community Shield. Um, I'm just going to quickly go to the office. We do have some uh, promising players here. Um, so I'm just going to go through these quickly and be right back. Okay, so actually, uh, I actually went through and deleted most of these uh, players because I actually forgot to put any specific uh, position. And uh, from the players we have, I think we... Um, Let's think about it. Uh, I'll have a think and then I'll go back and do it when I'm ready. Okay guys, so um, looking at this, I am straight away going back down to striker because I think we do need someone on at, for striker. Because Ibrahimovic could retire at any minute and you never know if Rashford is going to want to move on or not. So I think I'm going to set instruction to striker and then we'll move on. Okay guys, so looking here we have a transfer offer for Ander Herrera from Spurs who actually offered me 25 million and uh, I'm going to reject it because he's just someone I need in my first team right now and uh, I don't really have someone I can replace him with that's going to be big enough. So we'll go ahead, we have a news article here as well, um, thing that we're going to be finishing third in the league, it's optimistic, um, it's going to be very tough to get into that top four. Uh, especially, I've got a few players that do tend to get injured a lot. But uh, actually, I think the club that uh, predicted top are actually uh, looking here. Probably going to be Chelsea because you've got United there with three point uh, predicted finish of third, City with second, I know Arsenal were fourth, and Liverpool were seventh. So I think it's going to be Chelsea that are predicted first. And are going to be the biggest trouble. Okay, guys. So, we are back on the emails again. And we have Ricky, who has uh, accepted his contract at the uh, at the club, which is fantastic news. Our, obviously, a uh, young startlet that we've been given. So, I will put him up for loan. And uh, we also have a transfer here for Morgan Schneidlin from Real Madrid, who want him. Uh, they've got abundance of midfielders. I'm not sure he's going to get game time. I need him at the club. He's a great player, I think. Maybe we should be playing him next to Pogba in real life, but uh, honestly, I'm, we're going to go ahead here to transfers. We're going to sell some players, and we are actually going to find this little Ricky. Uh, I can't remember how tall he was. He was... Let's have a look at his stats, actually. He's not too bad. Uh, strength is decent. I think he'll be... a great little player um, we're just gonna add him for a, a year because I don't know how good he's gonna how quickly he's going to progress and I'm um, bigger clubs might want him but at the moment I'm gonna go through all of these um, young strikers pick out all the good ones and then we'll be going straight into the uh, community shield okay guys and here it is the community shield against Leicester I think I'll be putting out the first team definitely. Uh, here, <coughs> it's a very respectable trophy, and maybe winning this will definitely uh, get our manager rating up. So uh, we're just going to go straight into the game and see what happens. Okay, then, guys, here it is, the Cham uh, Community Shield. Sorry. <laughs> uh, there it is, the Community Shield. <coughs> Looking uh, good as ever. A few usual suspects, I'm presuming, for Leicester City here. Just see players shaking hands. Abramovich, I think I actually skipped through the Leicester lineup, but we can actually have a look at it going through here. So I'll well, just go into player ratings and see who they're playing. Obviously, the 4 4 2, usual suspects, strongest team. No Morgan has been dropped for. Luis Hernandez. Other than that, uh, there's no Danny Drinkwater. 
But uh, I still think that's a very solid team and could cause our defence a lot of problems. Going forward here with Ander Herrera. They're going to pass this off to Luke Shaw. Going to find Pogba. Ooh, Pogba close. Back to Herrera. Drill it in at the back post. It's close. Ten minutes in. Ready pushing the defence. Got the ball here again with Ander Herrera. We're going to spread out wide to Ander... Uh, not Ander Valencia, that's his brother. Uh, Antonio Valencia. Going to get to Paul Pogba. Rooney's in some space. Oh, nice tackle there by Amati. On the break here again with Ander Herrera. Been playing excellently so far. Up for Martial. In for the Pog. Oh, someone had a little nip on his heels. Crosses in with Mickey Tari and back post. It's gone in. And I think that's an own goal there. Mikatarian is going to celebrate the goal, but I think that is actually an own goal. We crossed the ball in here. Oh, and I think that is Robert Hoof who has hoofed the ball into his own net. I made it 1 0. Cheap goal, but goals to go on the end of the day. Oh, let's run a break here. Straight away after we scored the goal. Oh, nice block by Chris Smalling there. On a break here from their corner. Awful pass from Rooney. Maybe not. It's gone straight to Martial. Got to finish it. Not good enough. Maybe should have taken that a little bit earlier. Put a bit more power on it. We did get a corner. And we're going to put it just here. Someone to run onto. Herrera goes for the show. No. <coughs> Ball here with uh, Ibrahimovic. Passes it across. No one there. Can we pick it up again? We're going to challenge for it. No. Oh, Martial picks it up. In that box. Great save. Side hands. He's come off the bar. Heads into play. Cleared by Leicester there. Now Slimani's picked it up. Here's Jamie Vardy. Back to Slimani. They're on a break. Need to be careful here. Slimani's very technical on the ball. Takes it past one. Great block by Chris Morlin. Picked it up again. As a shot. It's bounced off the par. Oh my goodness. That was so close. Here Vibrimovic gets the... Whoa. Slam down. Maybe we can get back on a little attack here. There's Mkhitaryan. Rooney plays it in. Martial. Rooney. Rooney's been given the penalty. I think that was Hoth again making the mistake. Uh, let's just have a look at the replay here. Rooney picks up the ball. Didn't get Rooney at all. Just went straight between his legs. Gave him the chop. And we're going to give it to Ibrahimovic. Adjusting our start position. Pop it up there. And there's the second goal, Ibrahimovic. So we're going to give it a cheeky dab as well, just for that. Two very, very lucky goals here, but we're 2 0 up at the end of the day. And guys, that is half time at 2 0. Um, we're going to. I think we're playing decently. We've had three. Leicester have had more opportunities. We're dominating the ball, getting three shots on target. Okay, one was an own goal. But let's see how we do in the second half. Got the ball here, Martial. Back to Herrera. Paul Pogba there. Oh, brilliant pass to Luke Shaw. Gets the ball in the box. Rooney's there. Herrera has a pop at it. Oh, what a goal by Hander Herrera. Oh, my God. That's worth a dab. Holy crap. That was a strike and a half. Keeper's got nothing there. Crossed in. Cleared there by the Leicester player. Takes a touch, two touches, absolutely smashes it. Top bins, nothing you can do to stop that. 3-0. Leicester got the ball here. Oh, and Mares misses the opportunity on his left foot. Strongest foot. Missed it. Although I've just handed the ball back to them here. Zaini Bardi has the shot and it is gone wide. And we're actually going to make some uh, substitutes now. We're at the 63rd minute. Uh, we're actually going to bring on Juan Mata here. We're going to put Jesse Lingard out on the right. And we're going to give Marcus Rashford a go in the central position up top. Let's see how they do. Last one on attack. Chris Smalling can't get him. Bailey's on the floor. 
Oh, and that's another waste opportunity by Leicester. Danny Drinkwater missing the opportunity this time. It looks like Leicester have gone ultra attacking. Giving us a chance to score some more goals, maybe. Going to get for Jesse Lingard here. Jesse Lingard and Rashford. Two fresh men on the field. Rashford can't quite get past Robert Hoof there. And now, Slimani misses an opportunity. Another opportunity for Leicester goes begging. Here's Juan Mata. No more Juan Mata. Leicester on another break again. Coming forward with Riyad Mahrez, who's got the dribbling. Oh, that's very lucky not to have a free kick or something there. He pretty much dropped him to that floor. Chris Smalling's got to get that. Oh, Moose has done very well. Got the ball in for Jamie Vardy. And the goalkeeper manages to just about catch it with the ball bouncing around. Now we've got Martial, who is on a charge. Tries to get it into Juan Mata, gets shoved to the floor by Hernandez. But he picks it up again. Martial. Here's Mata. And the ball flicks off of Marcus Rashford and goes out of play. And another striker coming on for Leicester here. They really are trying everything to get back into this game. Big ball forward. Nothing from it. Ball forward for Rashford here. What can he do? Got Leicester swarming him. You got Herrera again. Who in a last ditch effort. And that is the full time whistle. And Manchester United. First trophy. We have won. The Champions uh, uh, Community Shield. FA Community Shield. There's the celebrations. Captain Chris Smalling. Why Wayne Rooney wasn't the captain. A Probably because he did come off. So Chris Morning has taken the armband and will raise the community shield for Manchester United. First trophy won of the season. How many more do you think we can win? Just looking at the stats here. Leicester just not taking the opportunity. He's had a lot more opportunities than me. But again, the Sharks are 11%. Not really acceptable for a Premier League club. Okay, so we're going to be going into some training after the match again. Rashford, Marshall and Bailey on the training. First team players obviously do come first. And I think when now Rashford hits in 80, we might take him out. Martial will leave him in there for a while. And we might swap Bailey in a few training sessions, but we'll give him a bit of an opportunity. Uh, so now we will be going on to Premier League matches. And also maybe making an offer for a, a striker which has come through. Okay guys, we do have some more emails to attend to. We have a match rescheduled against Southampton. We must have a chance for, for Matteo Damian. Now, I, I said that I would transfer right back, but um, I think we're just a little far too into the transfer window to scout some and get a new one. But in January, possibly if an offer did come up, um, we could end up selling our Valencia or Damian and replacing them with a younger, more promising future player. Okay guys, we do have another channel topper for Sergio Romero here, who Marseille have been bidding for. And uh, they're just under. I don't really want to get rid of Romero right now, so we're just going to reject. And so guys, we are into our first Premier League match here against Bournemouth, actually. Um, we'll probably be playing the first team. Uh, we do have some more striker issues. Uh, strikers that have come through, so I will look at them after the match and uh, maybe put some in the shortlist in a minute. But um, uh, we have got a, uh, we are slightly just having a look at some top deals here. Actually, Chelsea have actually brought in um, Martinez and Abamyang, and uh, also I was looking in the news article when it was uh, scrolling through the days. It actually looks like Chelsea have also bought Socrates as well. So they've completely transformed their centre-halves. Which is very, very strange. But we are going to go ahead and play against Bournemouth after we've looked in the calendar for this month. Uh, we do have a... Do have a, quite a few games. Not too many games. We actually have Southampton. So I think I will actually play... 
a few of the second uh, team players just to make sure that the team is well and truly ready for wait I'm pretty sure I chose the other kit there we go uh, we're actually going to go ahead and go into team management here and uh, have a look if there's anyone that played particularly well <clears throat> um, I don't really think there's I think we will just go ahead it's first game of the season actually and I want to see how the first team plays so we'll go hell strut out well as the referee at the Vitality Stadium let's see if we can pick up a okay guys here we are we are at the Vitality Stadium right now looking at the teams there is the big boy David De Gea with a nice little beard right there I want to actually see if we do see the team sheets okay so it turns out uh, I think I actually skipped through the team sheet so we'll just have a look on here they've got a pretty solid lineup Graydell, Wilshere, Fraser and Wilson and uh, obviously hits in goal new goalkeeper so um, we'll see how many goals we can put against them and if they've shown any Bournemouth looking very promising here already had to clear that with Smalling actually still on the attack they're playing very nice football here small in Bailey oh just wide just just wide got the ball here Wayne Rooney gonna have it to Herrera we know what a bang he has gonna try and work some space here's Mickey Tarion Wayne Rooney can't quite get there. Big boy Abramovic! Saved by hits. Take the corner. Smalling's up! Again, very nice header. Not quite on target though. Bournemouth on the attack. Crossed in. Well dealt with. Although it's back out to Charlie Daniels tackled well ball forward for Ibrimovic not quite there here's Martial Pogger uh, Ibrimovic slots in 1-0 very sweaty goal but Bournemouth player very rigid they got very stacked midfield hard to break down not many gaps and uh, there was a good run by Marshall to take the defender on just pass it across I thought it was going to go to Pogba but actually Ibrimovic takes it and makes it 1-0 oh Martial on the right oh, on the left actually Ibrimovic can't quite get past not as nimble as he used to be in his day old Ibrimovic bless him Martial 2-0 I was very silent there but uh that was a nice missed the run by Rooney actually there's the run by Rooney just passed it back across Martial bangs it in for 2-0 this is getting a little bit easy I mean we might have to put up to a legendary throw although it is against Bournemouth so uh we'll see we'll get to about halfway through the season and then we'll consider putting up to legend Bournemouth on the attack here actually a little bit dangerous nice save by David De Gea there and that guys is half time and we are leading Bournemouth two goals to nil Ibrimovic and Martial with the goals we'll have a look at the match stats uh, uh, here we go actually we don't see the match stats so I will just go on with the second half I think and make some subs around the 65 70 minute mark again Bournemouth here on the attack again still on the attack Paul Pogba wraps it up no he does not Oh, what a save by De Gea. Nice little save there. Now, maybe we can get on the break here. No. Maybe, actually. Mkhitaryan carries on that run, we can. Oh, nice tackle there. Nice tackle. Ball forward for Ibrimovic. Can he get there? Holds the man up. Oh, it's lovely. Abramovic makes it 3-0. That's what he's good at. Getting in that box. Holding up the players. Holding them off. 
getting the finesse on it. Oh, it's lovely. The Vitality Stadium has been well and truly put to bed. Great little control. Turns. And shoot. Oh no, Bournemouth! Bournemouth have just made it 3 1. Nice cross here. Crossed in, no one's at the back post. Pogba shoots, scores 4 1. Pogba there, got to do a bit of the dabbing for Paulie P. Dab it, dab it, dab it, dab it, and dab it some bloody more, mate. 4 1. Game, set, and match. Brilliant result here. Will we get any more goals? There's only one way to find out. Okay, so the 84th minute, I've actually decided to make some substitutes. The team is playing very well, so I didn't see any reason to take anyone off, but I'm actually going to be bringing on Fellaini for Herrera, bringing on, taking off Rooney, and actually taking off Ibrahimovic as well. And that, guys, is full time. Uh, we did end up being Bournemouth 4-1. Uh, not many chances came after I made them substitutes. It's a very equal match, but again, having a 90-rated goalkeeper in your team really does help. And Liverpool and Arsenal actually drew one all. So a uh, better result for Arsenal this time, uh, rather than real life. Sorry any Arsenal fans, but uh, just had to put that in, I didn't know. Okay guys, and to finish up the episode, we will be doing some training uh, while this is going on. Next episode, we will be looking at some strikers to purchase. And honestly, just going on with Premier League matches. I'm um, planning to do probably three matches an episode. And uh, we'll just actually have a look at the news at the end of the episode while I'm uh, finishing off. We've got uh, Chelsea accepting a 26 million bid for Matic. Uh, also, and uh, Chelsea looking to buy Bojan and Casemiro. Uh, Bournemouth hoping to sign Videla. Uh, Usted has moved to West Brom. Nacho has pledged his loyalty to CSK. And Wolfsburg are looking to buy Perica. Uh, so yeah, that has been today's episode. If you guys have enjoyed, remember to smash the like button. Uh, leave any comments and any further series for the idea. Uh, any ideas for the series. And also subscribe if you haven't already. It would be so much appreciated. Uh, also, I'm the man manager rating 84 right now. So we're actually doing very well. Uh, yeah, so if you did enjoy, show some support, show some love, press that like button. Hope you guys enjoyed, and I'll see you in the next episode. Goodbye.